Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Minecraft Advancement Hunter. My name is Ryan, and I um, am literally starting right back where we left off. I'm recording this the instant after uh, the, the last episode because... Um, we just need to continue building this house. Uh, this That's the biggest thing. This stuff even has, hasn't even finished smelting. Um, so we need to just keep going with this house. We need to get this thing done nice and pretty. Um, and uh, yeah, just make it, you know, f fully work this base out. Uh, just because I think it will be best if we have a good base of operations for the next... Um, for the next stuff that we're going to go chase after. We're going to chase after our advancements and stuff. So... Let's do it. The first thing I want to experiment with is the floors because I don't entirely know what I want to do. I'm debating if I want to do something with these um, just because these these stripped spruce logs look actually really neat. To get these, by the way, if you don't know, you just right click on an actual log and it just strips all the bark off. I think that could look really nice with the spruce um, just because we're using oak here. Um, let's just like, build, put a, a line here, a couple lines. Um, it'll be much more expensive than if we were just using planks, but I think it could look really nice. Um, I'm debating if we do want to do like a pattern or something or what, but I think this could look really good. So if we just do this. It's going to use up our axe durability like nothing else. That'll be, yeah. Actually, that has like a slight red tinge to it too. That kind of, that kind of looks nice. I, I don't know. Uh, let's try a different thing here where we just have the corners all... Uh, we could, ooh, you know what we could do? We could do some fun, interesting designs um, with these, where we have um, do, things doing this, uh, if you know what I mean. Here, let me, let me uh, do a little bit of that, and I'll show you what it looks like in a sec. Something like this, where there's a subtle pattern, um, but nothing too crazy. Uh, I don't know what we would do down the middle. I don't know if we want to just do these logs like that, uh, or if we want to just do i don't know like normal you know like this um but i think it could be really nice i think it kind of looks interesting with these these little bits here let me really quickly switch off this texture pack and see what it looks like just default wow i forgot how different these textures were in just the normal minecraft and it also feels so much more like blocky than this this version here okay uh my normal one yeah that looks really interesting that looks way different actually yeah, you can see these much more clearly, and you can kind of see the more well-defined lines there. Gosh. That looks so different. And oh my goodness, I forgot how different these things looked. Like, look at the potatoes and stuff, and the carrots, and the wheat. All, all the textures, like, with the 1.14 update look so different. It's so strange. I really just like the, the texture pack that I've been using, because this these stuff, these things look look real weird. I mean, this looks way better like this. Uh, I really like that, but everything else looks so strange. The bushes look the same just because that hasn't been updated in my texture pack, but dang, I like my my, my version a lot better. Here, let me, uh, I'm gonna switch back real quick. There we go, that's a little bit better. Um, that looks really nice compared to what the other one looked like. Honestly, I kind of prefer this look of the game. Um, I don't know if I like the new textures that much. Gosh, that's so insane. That's so crazy that they're they're so different. Um, but yeah, I think this could be a really fun floor design. Uh, I don't know if I want it exactly like this. I need to really experiment with it and see what it looks like with just different shapes and different orientations of the blocks and stuff. Ah, gosh, I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna experiment a little bit. Yeah, I mean this looks really good, like just by itself, just kind of simple like that. I don't know how much I like these lines. Um, let me try alternating the, the orientations of these. That looks real interesting. Um, I kind of like it. I don't know. I really don't... Ugh. Gosh, why is flooring so difficult? This is what it looks like compared to normal spruce. And honestly, it could be interesting to mix the two. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I kind of like how that little space is there. I kind of like that. I, I think it's kind of neat. Uh, I think what could, what could be really nice if we just did this. If we filled in all of this space down the line here with just the normal planks as just sort of the entryway thing. I don't know. Let me try that. Yeah. 
yeah, I kind of like that. I think that's that's simple and easy. And then we can do another uh, another bit of that here. Um, I don't really know. Uh, how does just the normal spruce look? Gosh, how does the normal oak look in this texture pack? Because the normal oak looks much more, oh, uh, looks more gray. And then that's what it looks like stripped off. Okay. Gosh. This is a struggle. I don't know what to do with the, with the floors. The floors are just a struggle, guys. What might be best is if we just did this little sort of design for the next four and then did the rest with the spruce here. Uh, just the, or the spruce planks, just because the the roof, and then if we do a ceiling, if we do a um, a, a second floor, uh, we're really gonna need some other stuff. I do want to try. We're really gonna need the the things to be similar and easy to do. I do want to try maybe making. I know this stuff over here is all water underneath it. It could be kind of fun to make a glass floor. Um, this isn't all water though. Shoot. Um, I do know what this stuff is though. We go for. I just make a little glass floor over here. Yeah, we'll make this little bit here a glass, a glass bit, um, just because I think that'll look nice. Uh, yeah, there's there's a there's a light coming from down here. I, I swam down here earlier. Uh, I'll just put a torch down. Um, and there's there's like a, a little bit of tiny little cave down here that had like literally one piece of iron. So not really worth it, but it was it was there. Um, okay, so let's go back up here. Um, see what's up. You can also see kind of just underneath. This is what it looks like. I might fill in some walls here some walls um, but Yeah, I don't know I Really just need to experiment with it like I really I since even though I don't you know really know what I'm doing I just need to kind of mess around with it and uh, I, I'll find something I like I, I'm sure I will um, but at the point I'm at now, I don't really know. Okay, so I left these kind of how they were, just without stripping them, just to see what it looked like. And honestly, I feel like these probably, to me, uh, look a little bit better, and they just match a little bit better to these than these logs do. So I'm gonna just, yeah, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna match that real quick. I think this axe is gonna probably pop in a sec here, um, but that's okay. I can make more. Uh, that looks, yeah, that looks way better. And then I think the rest of this will probably just stick with the spruce. Um, we could surround, I think that could be really fun, is if we surrounded this little bit here with um, some more logs. Uh, that could look nice. Um, but for now, this is, this is looking pretty good. The rest of it will all be spruce planks and uh, I think it'll look really nice so I will show you what that looks like when I'm done with it okie doke so here's what I've done is this is all the spruce planks and then this is glass and I just kind of surrounded these with normal um oh the normal you know logs I'm debating whether I want to just you know strip them of the of the bark um gosh it looks pretty good how it is uh i feel like it might look better with the strip though i'm gonna i'm gonna just do this yeah i think this will look better oh there goes the x um <laughs> yeah i think that'll look better just that that one piece there i need to make a new axe joke and here we go and boom yeah that looks that looks nice that'll be fine um i am also debating one thing here if i want to just take all the the wood off of these and replace it with the oak um, just because those will be, those will look nice, or maybe not, you know, strip those ones, but it could look really nice to, to do, to, to, to do some oak there. Um, I do need to figure out a floor in here. I think I'll just do simple, uh, just go spruce planks here. Gosh, I might, you know, spruce planks it and then carpet. I think the carpet could look nice. Hello, drowned, my dude. I don't really want to talk to you, but, you know, I might. That's eh, fine, I'm not going to talk to him right now. Uh, <coughs> um, yeah, this looks pretty good so far. This is just the floor. We still need to do the roof. Um, so let's let me uh, scoop all this stuff out, and uh, we'll put in just some. I think we'll just put some. Maybe we'll just put oak planks. No, oak planks will look bad. Maybe we can put um, birch. I wonder what it would look what it would look like if we put some birch in here. Birch is one of the one woods that we haven't experimented with yet. Uh, and I'm just curious. It could be nice to have a white floor like this. Um, that could be interesting. Uh, it could be just a light room in general. I just need to get more birch wood, which is not going to be super, super difficult. 
Um, yeah, I'm going to go on a little bit of a, a chopping spree for some birch. And, uh, and I'll be... Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, I'll be I'll be back. Uh, I'm curious, really quickly, though. What do the, the birch planks look like? Um, they're more creamy than anything else. Eh, no thanks. I'll just use these for for sticks or something. Another thing that we're going to do is, uh, eventually in the future, is get some of these dudes. Um, because we need to have an even better... Uh, food source and they're gonna be one of the best so um yeah another thing we could do is start uh hello to get on, stop no stop it stop um <laughs> another thing we might want to do is make an automatic shearing system for these dudes um just to get as much wool as possible i don't know what we would use the wool for but we would have it um and it could look nice as decoration and we could make more beds for more potential villagers in the future, which could be good. Um, but we'll see. Uh, the chickens will be helpful too, just because they're chickens and they give us chicken and feathers and eggs and all the things. So those could be really helpful. And, oh, I thought that was my ax breaking, but it was just white from the thing. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna finish getting all these and I'll finish up the floor and show you guys what it looks like. The house does look a little bit out of place, but honestly, that is just fine because it's probably gonna be more functional than pretty. Um, but you know, whatever, it's fine. And there we go. That's what it looks like. Um, I think, I think it's kind of nice. Uh, I do need to figure out, I'll probably put a bed here. Uh, in fact, let me grab my, my blue bed and put it there. Yeah. Yeah, that looks nice. Uh, one thing we could do is do the, the stripped ones on either side as kind of bed tables. Yeah, I kind of like that. Um, uh, and then we really need to torch, torch the place up. <laughs> which sounds like I'm burning the whole place down, but no, oh man, whatever, I'll just, gosh, freaking, I hate that the right clicking with the axes does that now, I thought I loved it, but now oh, all my materials are, uh, whatever, dude, whatever, that's so freaking annoying, okay, that's fine. Uh, I'll just make sure I don't right-click on the logs anymore, because, ugh, that's annoying. Uh, this will be interesting to light up that side. Uh, we'll have to wait till it's dark, probably. For now, though, I guess I can put them... How long is this? I don't actually know. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 11, 12, 13, 14, 1, 22. So 22, if we divide, go to 11, 1, 2, 3, 9... Maybe we'll go to nine, and then we'll go to nine again. One, two, three, eight, nine. Boom. That will probably work. Um, if it's too dark, I don't know what to do. Um, hopefully this will be lit up enough. It'll, it's going to get dark here in a sec, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, this looks generally pretty good. The next thing we're going to have to do is the roof, which I'm probably going to have to go for another, another chopping spree for. I mean, I've got a good amount of spruce planks and spruce logs and stuff. I might be able to make it, but it's kind of a lot. So we're going to kind of play that by ear. I do have enough of the birch to be able to make that floor birch again. Uh, let me just pop up here. I think that could be good. Um, yeah, I'll just make this, this roof out of birch as well. Just to, you know, continue, you know, have some sort of continuity between the... the bottom there and the top uh this room is just going to be very bright um and beautiful and it's great it looks good these are these have such intricate designs i love it yeah yeah this looks nice i like this uh i didn't want to do that i wanted to do this i am missing a single torch one torch just just one torch <laughs> And I say I need one torch and I build half a stack. So here we go. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Um, yeah, that looks nice. I think that'll be good. Uh, we could replace those um, those tables with something else later down the road. But for now, that looks good. Okay, now that it's getting dark, let's go ahead and see how lit up this is. Because um, if it's not lit up enough, mobs can spawn inside, which I do not want to happen. Uh, I'm going to let it just get dark enough that things start spawning. Um, I think it's gonna start. It's, 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 it's. I think it's already dark enough. It's probably already dark enough. Um, and yeah, this looks pretty lit up and pretty good. 
in here, of course, is going to be very bright and beautiful, and there's no problem here. And we can watch the sunset through our giant windows over here. Nice. I wish the sunset, like, down there. That would be really cool so we could see the whole span of it, but whatever. Um, this looks pretty good. So I'm going to sleep for the night, eat some food, and we're going to start on the roof up top. Literally all I'm going to do for this roof is um, just I, I need it to be easy to have as a floor for the future. So we're literally just, I think we're going to make the whole thing out of spruce planks and then make a sunroof in the middle. Um, I think over this part here, we'll, we'll kind of make a, a bit of a sunroof. I don't really have much glass. I might need to get more, but I think for now, we'll just kind of make all of this stuff out of spruce because I think that will look good enough. I think this will be the general size of the roof here, uh, or the sunroof. Um, just, I think it'll be more fun if it's really big. Uh, and I need to get back up here. <laughs> I uh, realized I came down and I don't have a good way to get back up. So I'm gonna fill this in. I'm gonna run out of spruce. Uh, let's make some more spruce planks, uh, just for here and for here. Um, and then, yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna fill in a couple bits here. And uh, we're going to fill this in with glass. Uh, I need to make more glass, probably. But there's sand all over the place. I can I can get more glass. Okay, and that is the planks done. Um, and I think that looks pretty good. We're going to... I mean, it's going to look pretty blocky from the outside. But, you know, it's Minecraft. So, that works. That actually, yeah, that doesn't look terrible. Um, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I think it looks good. Sweet. Woo! Okay, so currently we have eight glass. Um, uh, well, now we have seven glass. Um, that is, ugh, I hate that so much. <coughs> um, yeah, so we have enough glass to make um, basically none of this. So that's cool. Um, there's there's sand cooking in there, and uh, yeah, um, this is this is going. This is going. And there are the last three. Boom, nice little skylight there. Let's see what it looks like underneath. And I'm gonna close up this roof pit, 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 pit there. Uh, pit, roof pit, nope, that's definitely not what it is. And my shovel broke, cool. Good thing I have a second shovel, okay. There we go, look at that, that looks pretty good. I can see the sun, there we go. Giant, scary looking sun. Um, there we go, folks, that is basically the outside and inside of the base complete in the next episode we're going to definitely be um working on putting some stuff in here i might even do some of that off camera just we have some stuff in here um and uh yeah this looks pretty fantastic i'm kind of really excited about this um yeah well uh hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you did leave a like subscribe all the things hit the notification bell because that's an important thing uh my outros are always different i i noticed that uh, they're they're always always different um so hopefully you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe all the things and i will see all you folks in the next video whenever that may be